Welcome back Fish Lovers, I'm JR for JR Aquariums and today we're going to talk about ghost shrimps. Everything you need to know about ghost shrimps we're going to discuss it in this video. Water parameters, feeding, tank mates, everything you need to know even if you're a beginner or you keep them before we're going to cover it in this video. So stay tuned all the way till the end so you don't miss any crucial information. So let's get started. Now let's go over water parameters, but first don't forget to hit the subscribe button, ring the bell so you get the notification anytime that I upload a new video. Alright, ghost shrimps like a higher pH water from 7 to 8, but they can also live as low as 6.5. But like I said, they love a higher pH, 7 to 8 is where they thrive and they do better. They also love hard water. What hard water means? It means that the water has essential minerals such as calcium and magnesium. For me in my aquariums, I use always crushed coral to naturally bo boost that hard waterness in all of my aquariums. I'll also add some aquarium salt and calcium. I make my own calcium and it will be available soon. Temperature. Ghost shrimp love 72 to 82 degrees. They can live in colder temperatures, but they do best at this temperature. If you're trying to grow them faster or reproduce them, I recommend to put the water at 82 degrees Fahrenheit. This simulates warmer months and improves their metabolism and they also reproduce faster. But remember, if you do this, they only will last a 6 to 8 months they will die faster than normally. Feeding. Ghost shrimps are omnivores. What this mean? This means that they can eat plants and they can also eat meat. They are also scavengers. What scavenger means? They will eat everything and anything that falls down into the bottom of the tank, including decomposition matter. Their main food source is algae. They love algae, but they will also eat flakes, pellets, and also wafers. Remember, if they don't have algae to eat, it's recommended to give them some algae wafers. Now, the next question is, how often should I feed my shrimp? Ghost shrimp, they love to eat, so they always in the scavengering hunt, they always looking for food. So if you're trying to reproduce them, I recommend at least twice a day and you need to make sure that you feed them with any type of food that it will sunk to the bottom of the tank. If you are a really busy person, at least feed them once a day. Let's talk about tank size and tank mates. Ghost shrimps are really small, but people recommend at least a five gallon, but myself, I always recommend minimum of 10 gallon aquarium, even more if you're trying to reproduce them. Let's talk about some tank mates. Ghost shrimps are really, really peaceful. That's why you cannot mix them with anything, but you can mix them with mystery snails, neon tetras, brittle nose pleco, rasboras, platys, mollies, sword tails, and whoopies. This will be the perfect tank mates for them. Lastly, let's talk about breeding. Ghost shrimp females are larger than males. And also, you can identify them if they are pregnant and they are carrying eggs. Other than that, it's really hard to identify the males and females. Even in pet stores, it's really, really hard to know what are the females and the males. That's why it's recommended to at least buy 20 ghost shrimps, and that way you will have a higher chance to get a male to female ratio up. Also, if you want to speed up this process, you need to higher up the temperature of your tank to at least 82 because this will help with your metabolism and simulate those warmer months where they reproduce. If you have any questions, please leave a comment in the comment section and we will answer you as soon as possible. This is JR from JR Aquariums. Have a good one. I hope you enjoyed the video, 
So don't miss any other information. Please make sure you subscribe, hit the bell notification. That way, anytime I upload a new video, you will get that notification and you won't miss it. Thank you for being here and supporting this channel. See you in the next one.